Wow. Hey, everybody. Robert Griffin III's amazing performance tonight against the New York Giants with the Washington Redskins won 17-16. Caps an amazing week for rookie quarterbacks in the National Football League. We've had Andrew Luck and a dramatic last minute, last second drive to beat the Detroit Lions, and then Brandon Whedon basically running, throwing rough shot over the Oakland Raiders, Brandon Whedon, the Oklahoma State quarterback who some said was too old to play quarterback effectively, and now he's burning up the league himself. And then, of course, Russell Wilson, what they some call dangerous Russ or dangerous for the Seattle Seahawks, who beat soundly in the last minutes the Chicago Bears. Put all of these performances together what does it mean? It doesn't just mean that we have an outstanding crop of rookie quarterbacks. This isn't by accident. This is the end result of a long transformation between high school, college, and the NFL in terms of systems and how system concepts, I mean schemes like, for example, the read option or the spread option, have gone from college and high school up to the NFL. You know, the last time we had a transition in the reverse was the West Coast offense, or the Bill Walsh offense, as I prefer to call it, going back to college and then high school. But with the advent of the Internet and digital media and a new generation that is willing to try anything and is less likely to bow to convention, we've had all kinds of neat concepts, including the pistol offense and, of course, the gigantic five wide receivers and of course some systems with four wide receivers on one side and one receiver on the other. A dramatic, dramatic change has come over football and not only that, even at the peewee football level we have offenses that look just like their NFL, high school and uh, college counterparts, just like them. And the quarterbacks, even though they're what, eight years old, in terms of throwing motion, look just like their older counterparts. Amazing. I tried to explain this to Mike Mayock some years ago when I was interviewing him at the NFL Draft. I don't think he got what I was saying. He, was, he took it as an affront that I would even say that college or high school was actually more advanced in terms of the development of the passing game than the National Football League. But ladies and gentlemen, it is. And it's that, for that reason, it, including the introduction of some things, such things as package concepts, that the NFL is completely shocked by the impact of RG3, and it's going to be fascinating to watch and see how far the Washington Redskins go. But it would be even more fun to see the Indianapolis Colts play the Washington Redskins in the Super Bowl, although I would prefer to see uh, the... Well, that means they have to get past the Broncos. I have to think about that one. Because hmm. I want to see Peyton Manning get a ring. Oh, well, to be continued. <laughs>